Def Jam teases a new Fight 4 insert here. So if you follow the Def Jam account on Twitter, I don't know why, who's following record labels these days, get you Spotify, Apple Music, fuck a record label. Um, <laughs> but uh, this, I don't follow them. The only reason I know about this tweet is this tweet ended up on my timeline because somebody retweeted it. So the official Def Jam Twitter account, they tweeted out that, uh, let's say we bring back uh, the Def Jam fighting series, you know, Def Jam Vendetta, Fight for New York, and then the one we don't talk about that came out on Xbox and 360. Uh, in the tweet, Def Jam asked, the quote on, they, they posted an image, and then they put a quote, and they said, pick a city. And then in the image, it says, which one do you want to see next? Def Jam Fight for ATL, Atlanta. Def Jam Fight for LA, Los Angeles. Def Jam Fight for the Shy. Shy I was about to say Shy Rag, but I know people from Chicago hate that shit. Actual people from Chicago. So Def, Def Jam Fight for Chicago, and out of respect. <laughs> Even though it's a game about violence. Uh, Def Jam Fight for MIA, which is, of course, Miami. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and rule out Def Jam a Fight for Atlanta. I do not want to see that. I'm not really trying to see Young Thug uh, doing combos in a dress. I'm good on that. All that booty goon shit. Um, <laughs> Def Jam Fight for LA. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I guess I would want to see. I don't I don't like Miami either. I don't want to see a bunch of Kodak Blacks and shit. Uh, it'd be between LA and Chicago, but mainly I'm thinking Chicago. I've always been advocating Def Jam Fight for Chirac. I think that would be funny if the storyline took place in 2012. Uh, 2012 to like 2014, the height of the drill movement, and you get to uh, play like as Chief Keef and GBE and all this other shit. That shit would be fire. Um, plus, Chicago is a big city, so there's a lot of things they can do with that. My main thing is each one of these things has Def Jam in the name. A lot of artists are independent now, and a lot of artists are not on Def Jam if they aren't independent. I don't even know what artists are on Def Jam, but I will say for this game to work, because so many artists are independent now that are popular, I feel like it's gonna have to include artists that are not on Def Jam. They're gonna have to license out rappers that everybody wants to see. Like, you're gonna have to get Kendrick in there. You, you're gonna have to get Drake in there. You're gonna have to get J. Cole. Well, eh, I don't think J. Cole would participate in that. Kendrick, I, Kendrick is a, is a social rapper, a socially conscious rapper, but I feel like he's fun spirited enough that he would hop into the game just for the shits and giggles i don't know if j cole would do it i feel like he's too serious uh <laughs> to have any fun uh, as long as i don't know uh what other rappers would they would they be all the big rappers you know i want to beat up little pump uh <laughs> i want to i want to be able to beat up uh just like i don't know all these little soundcloud rappers like there's got to be like they got to do it in sagas right they got to do it in sagas. you know how like in dragon ball z they had the fucking sand saga the android saga fucking the freezer saga they got to have like the soundcloud saga look ooh, alliteration Ooh, that's that's fire right there yo def jam cut me a check I mean, the check, bring me in as a writer, bro. I got this shit. So there's got to be a SoundCloud saga where you got to play as like Kendrick Lamar and you got to go in and you got to defeat fucking Lil Skies and Lil Pump and uh, fucking all the other shitty SoundCloud rappers. Fucking, um, they also got to have like a Golden 90 saga where you got to play as Mob Deep versus fucking Wu Tang and shit. Uh, <laughs> fucking, you got to have a Biggie versus Tupac battle and shit. Uh, no guns, no guns, no guns, just hands just hands you know what i'm saying we bringing it back put down the guns pick up the hands that's what i'm for in the movement i'm not for like death and shit like that we gotta get like a gotta get a boss fight with fucking waka flocka versus gucci when they was beefing Ooh, you gotta do a boss fight where uh y'all remember when gucci man went on that twitter rant a couple years ago and he was just quote unquote exposing everybody you gotta do a boss fight gucci man versus twitter where he just airs everybody out uh <laughs> you gotta do you gotta do a boss fight drake versus kid cuddy and shit uh drake drake versus fucking uh push a t oh that shit would be fire oh uh fucking drake would have like a special ability where fucking he uh he sings and bitches go crazy so then he gets like a strength boost and push a t like if you he's gonna have like alternate costumes if you use the push a t without the fucking uh without the fucking long hair without the braids from like the, the Allen Iverson braids, like you're gonna move faster. But if you use the ones with the braids that everybody knows, you get a strength boost. Uh, anybody in the game with dreads gets a strength and a defensive boost. I'm telling you, yo, bring me in for ideas, Jeff Jam. I, I think it would be fire. I think the main thing is where, like they said, where would you want it to take place? Also, what rappers would you want to see in the game? 
because I think uh, I think it's time for another Def, Def, Def Jam. Just don't make it like the last one where you had to do the scratch and the tables and stuff like that. That shit was fucking awful. Make it like Def Jam Vendetta and Def Jam Fight for New York. Create multiple fighting styles and original story. Ooh, maybe even bring in some Bioware type of uh, type of aspects to the game where you get to choose your own adventure. Bioware, like uh, bring in a dialogue tree, I mean. So you get to choose what you want to say. And depending on what you say, it affects the story. So you can be passive or you can have an aggressive style. Um, oh, bring back girlfriends. What girlfriends y'all want to see in the game? Who's the baddest chicks in the game right now? I don't know. I don't know any. Uh, I don't know any fucking like video vixens. Do video vixens even exist anymore? I don't really watch music videos like that. Maybe bring in like some IG thoughts for like your girlfriend. So bring in like Bernice, uh, Bernice Buega. What, what is her name? Bernice something. You know, the 30, 37 year old chick, the grandma, but she bad as hell. Bernice. I'm about to Google this shit. Bernice Burgos. Okay, if you never heard of her, she's 38 years old. Pull up her IG. I swear to God, get the lotion out. Uh, yeah, bring her. Get like Bria Miles. Is Bria Miles still? I don't know. Is she relevant? I don't know. Whatever. Whatever's the hottest IG thought. Bring them in the game. You get to smash. You get to let them fight over you for your love. And also have heavy customization in it, okay? I want to have one, two, three, four, five, six choker chains, bro. I want to have shit on my wrist. I want to have... I'm just trying to ball. I want to... I'm trying to enter the battle arena with a fucking... With a fucking pit bull dog, dog. And I can use that dog as a kill streak like it's fucking Call of Duty, bro. I'm just saying, bro. I want to play some ignorant-ass fun shit. Come on, Def Jam. Bring that shit in this motherfucker, yo. Uh, and last but not least, what I want to talk about in the gaming section is... I am sick and tired of studios and uh, publishers and thanks for watching my video if you're new here hit the subscribe button and tap the bell icon so you'll never miss another video also consider pledging my patreon it helps keep the lights on there's a link in the description box below peace